Ashley Park reporting. In health news, an Oklahoma woman says because of the Affordable Care Act, her husband lost his insurance in almost his life. That's because her employer said they could no longer pay premiums for spouses. Dana Hartnicki has her story. Lenny Haas was just released from the hospital this afternoon after an ordeal that cost him part of his lung, well over $100,000 in hospital bills, and began more than two weeks ago. And all of a sudden, he uh, started getting sick. Doctors diagnosed him with pneumonia and said his lungs were filling with blood. Lenny, who is a self-employed contractor, was always on his wife's insurance. After that ended, premiums were too high for them to afford on their own, and they don't qualify for Medicaid. He's healthy. He has never went uh, into the doctor before. Without insurance, the couple believes they didn't get proper care at two hospitals, sitting at one hospital for nine days, while they say doctors did nothing before the couple demanded to be transferred to Mercy, where Lenny finally got help. They went ahead and removed half of his bottom of his lung, just because that blood was set in there so long. It will be a month before Lenny can return to work. In the meantime, Laura has been frantically searching for insurance they can afford. I couldn't even get the good insurance with it because that was um, $500 a month. 